Yes, it takes two computers to run MikeMulhern.net. Two hands, two computers. Beethoven did this, didn't he? I think it was Beethoven. Mike Mullen from MikeMullen.net, Bristol. Casey Mears is on the pole. Brad Keselowski on the outside. He's the one to watch. Jimmy Johnson, 37th. Why? Rain. Big thunderstorm rolled through just about the time they were supposed to qualify for Saturday night's Bristol 500. And Jimmy was slow. I'm not sure if he was sandbagging or not. I'm sure he's a lot better than 37th. Casey Mears and Brad Keselowski, the two fastest in the first practice session. And that's how they set the field these days when it rains. The story, the new trick rear end housing thing, whatever that is. I'm not sure what it is. A lot of guys seem to know sort of how it works. NASCAR says it's legal. Brad Keselowski was a little ticked off about the Hendrick guys and the Roush guys using it last weekend. Said it put him at a disadvantage. So we asked him today, okay, NASCAR says it's legal. Do you have it in your car? And will it work as well at Bristol, a short track, as it did at Indianapolis and Michigan? He smiled and said, well, I might have it in my car. You'll have to wait and see. And then we said, well, will it work on a short track? He said, about lap 250, you'll find out. You and me and 130,000 people, the Bruton Smith says, will be here for the, for the 500 on the newly ground racetrack. Not so sure that the new grind up high to eliminate the high groove, the Harry Gant groove, the Michael Walter groove is really going to work that much, but it's going to take a lot of the angles out of the corners for these guys. They get in a little too deep, slide up, they hit that high groove, they're going to be in trouble. They're going to be in the wall, Tony Stewart says. We asked Tony Stewart, are you getting tired of everybody talking about Danica Patrick and how bad she's doing this season? Well, he was sort of speechless. We said, we're getting tired of writing about how bad she is. She needs to do something good, something positive. He said, well, I don't know. Go ask NASCAR. <laughs> NASCAR marketing, I tell you. They're in high gear. Next year, thinking Steve Addington might be her, her cup crew chief. Not sure. A lot of people are doing some stuff behind the scenes. A lot of things going on. Check out the Michael Walter operation. I think there might be a shakeup coming there. Not quite sure what. I'm waiting for Martin Truex Jr. to sign a new deal. Will he do it in Atlanta next week? Maybe that's when Matt Kinsos is going to announce his deal with Home Depot. That's a Home Depot town. Not sure exactly how these sponsorships are going to play out. It's going to be interesting to see. And so will Danica Patrick's first cup race at Bristol. Me? I'm banking on Brad Keselowski. He's talking a good game. Irritated those Hendrick guys. Championship gamesmanship in my book. And I'm thinking Brad Keselowski is going to win the Bristol 500. We'll see. Mike Mullen for MikeMullen.net.